We start tonight learning more about the moments after a mother allegedly stabbed and killed her five year old daughter. This happened on Northfield Road in Bedford Heights. Our Carmen Blackwell has a 911 call and the latest now from police. I was calling on grandbaby to tell her that I, I bought her gift that she had asked me to buy her. Uh -huh. As soon as I called, her mother said, she's dead, she's dead, and God coming to get you. Saturday evening around 6.30, Bedford Heights police made a welfare check at an area apartment complex. It came after 29-year-old Minaka Neely told family members she harmed her 5-year-old daughter, prompting these calls to 911 dispatchers from the child's father and grandmother. She said, what's you again? She said she stabbed her. Your child's mother said she stabbed the baby? Yes. When officers arrived at the apartment, they found the body of five-year-old Enija Noel Holland lying on the floor in a back bedroom after she was stabbed multiple times. Detectives on the case tell us they have no leads yet on a motive for why Manaka would stab her little girl to death. It's unimaginable to think that somebody could do that to their child. Um, very, very sad story. Our hearts go out to the family, especially the child's father um, and their entire family. I couldn't imagine what he's going through right now. On her Facebook page, Neely frequently posted about her daughter, like this picture for little Elijah's fourth birthday, saying, quote, My day one, I love you. So happy you chose me to be your mommy. Neely Elijah's mother was arrested at the scene and booked into Cuyahoga County Jail. Her initial court appearance is set for Tuesday. Officers spoke with Enija's father, who told authorities he was currently in the court process of gaining shared custody of Enija. But COVID and recent snowstorms have delayed those custody hearings. Now he and the family are devastated after learning Enija is gone. In a few weeks, she would have turned just six years old. That was Carmen Blackwell reporting for us tonight.